My name is Hackett. I'm 43 years old. I live in Brooklyn, New York. Uh, I run an uh, art combine called the Madagascar Institute. You have the whole maker movement, right? You have all these people getting together to work on their projects and teach themselves technologies and use those technologies. We're towards the grimier end of things. Instead of fine, discrete electronics where everything is pretty and you have blinking lights, we have the cobbled together robot, monster, physical, dead end of technology that costs no money and blinks fire or blinks tears or people's crushed dreams. The maker movement is not about mighty, ma mighty maker on a hill, it's about the maker space, right? It's about a group such as Madagascar Institute. We're not really sure who's in it or who's not in it. It's a bunch of people working together and they're doing cool stuff there. They're learning cool stuff. There's a bunch of differences between what we do and what they do, but some of the core philosophies are the same. Specifically, one core philosophy that we have is that how hard can it be? Most stuff is not rocket science, but then again, rocket science is just plumbing and math. Things that you can only conceive of and that you've only seen in a movie or a video game or in that dream that you had after eating too much spicy food before, you know, where your teeth fall out at the end of the dream and you can't fly, but all the stuff that happens in between. You know, living the dream, living that kind of dream, that's what I like to do and just when you tell people about things, jets and then the fire and then blah, 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 and then God came down and, and you realize that, wow, they have no idea what point I switched over to fiction in that. And it doesn't matter because they're so entertained because they're impossible, they're ridiculous, they're tons of work for just an amazing moment of spectacle. If I can infect other people with that enthusiasm, then I've done my job. People can and will and may die. Why I keep doing it? Because it's awesome. It's incredible. It's worth it. Core of the Maker Movement is you can right? That these things are the sum of their smaller parts. You can look at those smaller parts. Your world is no longer mysterious. Your world is no longer alien. Your world is no longer for other people to understand and you to passively consume. You are a participant in the world. Hop on in. That is the best thing about the maker movement.